I'm Instructor Williams. And I'm Instructor Maciel. Today we're going to go over Block 1 of Medical. Very first thing is BSI Pin Man. You're going to get your general impression. That just means age, sex, weight, position. Next is Abpu. Alert, verbal, pain, unresponsive. If he responds to you, you know he's alert. Sir, sir, if he turns and looks at you, then he's alert. You're going to go ahead and approach him with your, with that, with your bag, get at eye level. Hello, sir, my name's Mr. Williams. I'm a paramedic. Well, how can I help you today? He's going to respond with his chief complaint. Today, his chief complaint will be chest pain. We know his airway is open, clear, and maintainable. So at this time, we're going to move on to block B. We know this because he talked to us. At this point, I'm going to go ahead and get out my stethoscope. I'm going to tell the patient exactly what I'm doing. Sir, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, count your respirations for a few minutes. Lean forward for me a little for a few minutes. At this point, I simply am not doing anything but placing the stethoscope on his back, and I'm watching him breathe for 30 seconds and then times it by two to get his respiratory rate. I'm looking for rate, depth, and ease. His rate is 18, depth is normal, and ease looks normal. At this time, I'm going to get his lung sounds. Because he's sitting up in a chair, I'm going to go ahead and get him on the front. I'm going to go ahead and take your lung sounds. Just follow my commands, sir. Take a deep breath and out. 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 Lung sounds are clear bilateral. At this time, I'm going to go ahead and check his SpO2 level. I'm going to go ahead and clip, turn this on and clip it onto his finger. SpO2 level is 91%. Please put the patient on 4 liters nasal cannula. At this point, I have delegated my partner to treat the breathing. We will move on to circulation. You can also see that I've taken over the clipboard because I've assigned him a task. At this point, I'm going to get his pulse. I'm going to get rate rhythm and quality by looking at my watch. I'm going to take his pulse for 15 seconds and times it by four. Pulse rate is 130 strong and irregular. At this point, I'm going to go ahead and get his skins by simply putting the back of my hand to his forehead. I'm looking for color, moisture, temperature. Skins are normal, normal, warm. Again, the pulse rate was 130, strong and regular. I'm going to get cap refill. Cap refill is immediate. And I'm looking for any major hemorrhaging. There's no major hemorrhaging. At this point, we're going to make a load and go decision. The decision is, because we have things outside of the normal area, including breathing and circulation, it is a load and go. This concludes block one of medical.